My name's John Halliday. Well, John, where are we tonight? It's a Monday night. Not a lot going on here, is there? No, no, this is Dalkeith Bowling Club at Iron Mills Road in Dalkeith. It's uh, pre-season. The outdoor season starts this weekend. Most clubs will be opening this weekend, but we start on Saturday and Sunday. So it all kicks off then. When did you kick off? Not in football, but in bowling. When did you start bowling? Early 80s, I started bowling. When we worked on shifts, I didn't, uh, couldn't participate a lot. But by the mid, early 90s, I got seriously involved in it and in the administration side of things as well. So I've been playing for quite a few years. Not just playing, right? You've got another role in Scotland, never mind here in Midlothian. What's that about? Yep, this uh, this year I'm the president of Bowl Scotland, which is a fantastic honour. As I've said before, I, I'm the custodian of the presidency for a year. It's been going for a long time because uh, Bowl Scotland was the Scottish Bowling Association, which was formed in 1892, I think it was. Yes, it's a great honour to be president of Bowl Scotland. I'm also president of Bowls Midlothian, which is a new organisation for bowlers in the county, in Midlothian area. Bowling's always been about for a long time. Different names, different faces, different people taking charge, different people taking up bowls and that. So what about bowling in Midlothian? Is it on the up or do you need that wee bit push? Yeah, I think bowling, like all other member sports club, th- there's a drop in membership. Hopefully we're halting that. We're slowing the drop down, but bowling clubs are the centre of communities in every village and every town in Midlothian. Bowls Midlothian organisation covers clubs from West Linton to... Musselburgh, Pathhead to Gilmerton, 30 clubs. We even still have founder members from West Lothian members of it. So the clubs are all still there, but they're, they're centres of community. We need to try and get them back in the forefront of the press, back in the forefront of the media, let everybody know they're there. And they're friendly places because they have to be now. We have to have open door policies. There's try bowls. Every club should be doing a try bowls where you can come along and have a throw at bowls. Been very successful in the past. We're riding in the back of fantastic bowlers in our area. Commonwealth Games medalists. From Midlothian, we've got David Peacock, Ronnie Duncan, Stacey McDougall, all Commonwealth Games medalists. Fantastic achievements. So that's what can happen from your own local wee bowling club. You can travel the world. So what you're saying is if anyone in any of the areas within Midlothian, check out your local bowling club, pop along and just introduce yourself or just go in and have a wee chat with some of the members and you never know then bowling might be for you. Yep, most clubs... If not all the clubs will offer coaching for for new bowls, new bowlers. And I I guarantee you that the the people we get who come to us in later in their lives, they're they're ex-golfers, rugby players, football players, they get to 50 plus and decide, I'm going to try bowls. And every one of them will turn around and say, I wish I'd done this earlier. Every one of them, guaranteed. So it's a competitive sport. Everybody can play 90-90. So you can play it. You can have four generations playing on the green. Not 24 hours 7, of course. No, no, it does rely on the weather because we are outdoor bowlers. And yeah, you, you can play in sunshine and snow. I mean, sunshine and hail stains, but uh, yeah, it does get uh, the weather. Very, very weather dependent. Future for Dalkeith Bowling Club, not indoor, but outdoor bowling club, is relying on new members and the word getting out there. That's what you're doing right now. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're planning to do, if our, not just for Dalkeith Club, but for all the clubs in Midlothian. We want to try and push, push the sport, get some new members in, We've got a good young setup, but we need to improve it. We need to get more kids involved. That's the future. So that's what we're planning on. If that's the future, then good luck. Thanks very much for the chat. Thanks very much, Russell. Thanks.